No, no Balak ain't here today. My name is Blake. Do you want to go to war, Balaki? No. Because we could go to war. No. Good morning. It is like 6 a.m. Okay, so I'm running a little late. I was going to make coffee, I was going to make breakfast, but now I need to leave like 10 minutes ago leave, so... Hi guys, so I'm in the classroom and the kids are at specials. It has been a lot of fun, I'm not gonna lie, it's a lot of fun. Um, oh, I didn't get to show you guys the fit. And these are the shoes. I got these at Play-Doh's Closet. This is from H&M. These are like $10, they were on clearance. Um, and I got this shirt at Play-Doh's and this is my cami that I thrifted. This necklace and then my pearls and my hair is in a braid, but um, it's been really fun. Um, I got here like 15 minutes late. I parked on the wrong side of the school and I walked the long way to find the front office in the rain. I got into the classroom, the teacher's aide was here and she was able to kind of very rapidly go over the sub plan. It's very detailed, very straightforward to know exactly what you should be doing. She took attendance for me. It was very much like the substitute teacher video, except she didn't care. Like she didn't make a big deal, right? But she's just like, okay, that's how you pronounce it. Like whatever. She just corrected herself, you know? Um, but the kids, they really like me and they're really loud, but they like me. I got a lot of drawings. <laughs> um, so they had to do like their morning work and when they finished I told them well okay well you can just draw or color because they all seem to really enjoy doing that so they were drawing and coloring and um they're getting loud but um I don't really mind the loudness or like the kids getting up or anything like that too much um it's more so the other teachers I know they don't really like it and apparently you know there's like rules whatever um and so yeah i just feel really bad like there's this one kid and he has a lot of energy he's probably adhd and all the other kids are like he's not supposed to be you know going crazy or whatever and i told him like hey can you sit down and he's like i can't sit down and i'm like okay like i understand you know that that's a thing and the other kids may not understand and like so i just kind of let him be and i'm sure the teacher already knows that he's like that so i'm not gonna you know call him out and make a big deal in the sub note um, I got lots of gifts. First I got a sticker, and then I got this fan. It's a rainbow fan. And then they drew me. That's me. Can you see? Yeah, that's me. And then there's this one. I like the frilly detailing to match my... Yeah, um, so that's me. And then I got this penguin one. I told him I... I liked the penguins, so he made me another penguin drawing. This one has an egg. And then I got this smiley face. And then um, one student, he traded um, one of the girl students some like ranger books so he could get this drawing so that he could color it and give it to me. And then this one's also me. Very sweet. Okay, so, finish the day. I'm tired. I lost my voice. Oh, sorry. I'm tired, I lost my voice, and kids are crazy. At the end of the day, they didn't listen to me. At all. Um, I was playing hangman with them, and I lost track of time, and apparently they released 30 minutes before the schedule that I got. So the teacher came in and got mad at me and was like, hey, they need to go. And then she's like, you're on daycare duty. And I was like, what does that mean? Where do I go? And all the other teachers looked really stressed out. And so I just walked up to a random teacher and was like, hey, sir, um, I'm on daycare duty. What does that mean? And he's like, oh, yeah, just, just follow me. And I was like, okay. Um, my classes like switched off and the class I switched off with their teacher was there so the teacher gave them a talk about listening to me and respecting me so they were kind of um, better kind of I don't know at first they were better and they listened to me and 
and they finished their work way faster like they knew what they were doing um but i think that just has to do with the fact that their teacher was next door so you know they kind of had that threat that if they were bad i could go call their teacher um and then i got my kids back and and they were they were absolutely bonkers chaos mass chaos um also another thing to note that i didn't really realize is that it's like really go 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 like i got there it was time to go to specials and then i brought them back and then it was time for lunch and then it was time for recess and i brought them back and they switched teachers and and we had to do like group restroom breaks because apparently on tiktok it got big for like kids to vandalize so we have to go as a group and i had to check before and after my class to make sure that nobody vandalized it was really annoying because one kid had to go to the restroom and it's like we all have to go all together so she had like pre-planned like break times but it was really hard to follow them because it was chaos like the time it went by so fast like looking back but when you're in it it feels endless like actually endless i think that's all for today um subscribe maybe i'll make more sub content because this is pretty crazy um yeah these are all the drawings i got from the day all totaled up i got some more um i got they asked what my favorite color was so i told them brown noodles is over there eating but i told them brown and so um i got this little guy and this this heart says best sub ever um i also got some really nice um they said they love me They really wanted me to stay, but I was like, you guys are crazy. Oh, look this one. Have you ever eaten a worm? Um, today went a lot better. I was substituting for a kindergarten aide and she kind of goes like from classroom to classroom and helps like um, conduct like intervention for some of the um, some of the kids that need extra help like they don't know their alphabet or they can't really write their name and so I went class to class like to four or five different classes even um, the teacher of the year um, he I had to go into his class for a little bit and got to see how he did things. He gave me some tips and pointers. Cause I figured, I mean, if I'm helping teachers, like I can see how they conduct classroom, how they deal with behavioral issues, etc., etc. Played this game called Splash, and it was a lot of fun. Like you just pick out a thing, and you're like, "What letter is this?" And they tell you, and then whoever gets to ten first wins. And if they pick up Splash, they have to put back um, a card. One of the teachers really liked me, and she got my um, my number that way she could message me if she ever had an opening and I was on lunch duty and um, I had a I was in charge of like pre kers and they were throwing food and Hitting each other and tickling each other. Nobody was eating their Well, okay when I say they were wait what did I say they were eating their food? My brain is so pooped and it's so hot and I'm wearing a sweater, but Anyways pre kers very nasty gross boogers everywhere. It was not for me. They're cute. They're they're cute. I'll tell you that. They're kind of like puppies. But the teacher that really liked me and got my number, she was telling me that she doesn't baby talk with them and stuff like that. Because then, you know, when you treat them like a baby, they act like a baby, which is really good advice. And I made down this whole list of things that I, I want to bring slash buy or look for. Like, I want platform sandals because um, I like sandals. These boots kind of kind of hurt low key. Um, it's really bright so i think i'm gonna go inside but thank you if you watched all the way to the end that's super nice of you um if you would like to like give it a like if you don't like still give it a like okay um that's all bye